Hello and welcome to this marionette tutorial. In this tutorial, we'll cover how to quickly get your animation from marionette into Reillusion's iClone and Character Creator 4 and retarget it onto your own custom character. Now, before we begin, we want to highlight our recommended workflow, which is to use our plugins for Maya and Blender. These give you full creative control, allowing you to retarget animations to any character rig, even non-humanoid characters, and refine the motion with a live preview before exporting to your final application. This tutorial, however, will focus on a direct drag and drop workflow for retargeting your animations right inside of iClone and CC4. So with that said, let's get started. We'll start in Marionette with our animation ready. First, navigate to the project menu, select export and click export timeline. Give your FBX file a name and hit save. Now, let's jump into iClone. With your character loaded in the scene, simply find your exported FBX file and drag it directly onto the character. It's important to drop it on the character itself, not beside it. The Motion Import Settings window will appear. Before converting, go to the Motion T-Pose option and click the folder icon. Select the exact same animation file you just dragged in, this calibrates the skeletons for a much more accurate retarget. Now you can click Convert All. And just like that, your animation is perfectly retargeted and ready to play. And for Character Creator 4, the process is identical. Drag and drop the FBX directly onto your character. Load that same file into the Motion T post to calibrate and click Convert All. And there you have it. A quick and direct workflow to get your marionette animations working inside iClone and Character Creator 4. If you found this helpful, be sure to follow us for more updates and join our Discord community to share your work. All the links are waiting for you in the description below. Thanks for watching and see you next time.